Appearance over authenticity. That's the motto of today. Results are what matter. I once read a comment on a YouTube video where someone said, it doesn't matter what the journey is. The end result is all that we care about. A horribly misunderstood soul telling someone who's made something of their journey that they didn't care until right then. I was pretty upset when I found that and I dismissed their comment, but they're right. What matters nowadays is who we are right now and what we provide for other people. What other people see, their eyes, who they perceive us as. <clears throat> they say eyes are a window to the soul, but nowadays they don't tell a whole story. You can't figure out who someone is just by looking into their eyes. Misguiding everyone you meet is a common trope nowadays. The guy wearing a Supreme hat. The girl singing so loud you can't hear her. The girl wearing a boy on her arm just for the night. None of, none of, these, none of those people are living for that moment. Attention is currency and inflation is real. It will always feel better to be invocated rather than invited to a party. And that's real attention. If, if someone's asking for you to be in their presence instead of just reaching out to you because they feel obligated, because they know you, and you know them, and you know that they're doing something, and they feel like you have to be there just because they know you, and you know that. That's not real attention. But no one cares about real attention. If only people could get past the fact that just because someone is looking at you doesn't mean they really give a fuck. And then we rely on our value systems and our morals and who we perceive ourselves as, as if we even fucking matter. In a grand scheme, no one even gives a fuck. Obviously, we all know this, and me saying it makes no change to how you perceive that line for the 500th fucking time. Still doesn't change the fact that no matter what, we will keep living under others' impressions. Held down by everyone else until we're too old and finally realize how to live life. If that even happens. Fuck what I'm saying anyways. These thoughts and ideas are all spewed from a tremendously narrow, poorly thought out view, view of, of my, my own, own reality. reality. Sitting here trying to tell people on the internet anything that they can derive meaning from. No one cares. What's the point? As you were, the stars of your own movie, I'll continue as the extra. At least let my line be, people are happier when they aren't lying to themselves.